my theme that I'd like to develop for a few minutes with you is that the economic climate of the last few years has created a unique opportunity for law students and society in general, while at the same time presenting enormous challenges to both the profession and the law schools. And I see the present as offering the potential, if the opportunity is not squandered, of growth and development for the legal profession, especially for junior lawyers. And I'm particularly pleased to discuss this here tonight because I know at Hofstra, public service is particularly emphasized. To put precision on the numbers that uh, Eric alluded to, we have 29 Hofstra alums in our 650 lawyers. And one of your 2009 graduates, we recently named one of our Rookies of the Year. Once you graduate from law school, the combination of the lack of readily available private sector jobs and the growing need for legal services in the public sector offers another challenge and another opportunity. Law students can work for the government, for organizations providing legal services for the poor or other nonprofit entities and receive the training and experience that they would get together with an exposure to a wide array of interesting legal issues that the private sector can no longer offer. And if you do this, of course, you will be benefiting your communities at the same time. There can't be much question that there's a need for this legal help. The recession has affected everyone. The need for lawyers' skills in government and the poor is on the rise. The government has expanded its efforts in many areas. There's certainly a growing need for lawyers in areas like security, immigration, white-collar crime, and bankruptcy. And the urgency of the need for lawyers in the government and public sector becomes more and more urgent every day, although the quantity of jobs is, as a practical matter, severely limited by funding restraints. But some parts of the government seem to be reacting. For example, New York State Judge Jonathan Lippmann recently released the judiciary's budget for the coming year, which included $25 million in new funding for civil legal services. At the same time, the economy has forced many young graduates to change their plans and forced them to go into the public sector. This isn't really a detour on your career path, but rather an exciting potential new path or a stepping stone to where you perhaps had not considered going before. Taking a job with a government or a legal services organization will help you see what else is out there, perhaps preparing you for a whole new opportunity that you hadn't thought of. You will certainly gain the opportunity to improve your lawyering skills. And as I said at the beginning of my talk, working in the public sector allows you to make a difference in cleaning up the environment, in protecting public safety, in defending an immigrant threatened with deportation, or defending a parent in a custody dispute. The experience you get in working with these clients and the contacts you make while calling someone on their behalf and the satisfaction you derive in doing this is unparalleled and in the long run will make you better lawyers and more attractive job applicants.